All right, y'all, we on day three morning. Tandy getting her shoes on. <laughs> you do a lot of things different. Sleep in a little, in a car camping that way. Oh, yeah. But I did sleep pretty good last night. It really started. Later than we did the night before. Uh, yep. Oh. Another bad storm to start the night. Mm -hmm. It wasn't near as bad the other night, though. The other night. Wind blowing. 70 mile an hour wind. <laughs> mm. yeah. We got to put our window down after it went through. Got a little string we put over our window here. Keep the bugs out. Let we'll some air through. Yeah, let some air cool air. So, all right, let's go see what we can get into. The mountains. Mm -hmm. Say what now? Say what? That look a little rough this morning. <laughs> Your hair's sticking. <laughs> I'm sure we both do. No, it is foggy, foggy, foggy here. Oh, man. All right. Feels good, though. Mm -hmm. All right, y'all, it's breakfast time and it is time. Yeah. <laughs> Editing time, yeah. Try to get show out here. Breakfast of champions. What you looking for they here? Are motorized, okay. Yeah. Well, it rained on us last night. Yeah. Yeah, we got to sponge that out. Okay. All right. All right. So, so we got to get the water out. We we, we done sponge them out once. Okay. We thought we hit it all, but we didn't. I'm gonna get some numbers here. So basically, gotta be dry. You know, yeah, clean grain and dry. Clean grain. No weeds attached anywhere. Okay. Okay. Um, so um, then we're gonna ask you some questions. Where are you been? Where are you going? Okay. Um, and how long? How long it since it's been in the water? Yeah, it's been two or three months since they've been in. Like I said, we had them super clean. When we left the house, but we don't run into two rains. <laughs> but they not weigh very well. You start working on that. All right. So let me help you get this drained out. Through a checkpoint. I don't know if we didn't strap it down good or what, but we lost our cover. The sandy <laughs> boat. That poor boat's been jinxed there, so that's the boat lost the Mississippi River. <laughs> it's quit on me time or two. But hey, we back going. Back going. So here we come, Wyoming. Alright, we've done got into Wyoming here. We're on Interstate 80. They start seeing some pretty scenery. Mm -hmm. A lot of what like rest areas or well, information, in, information centers. This one had a monument at it. Um, the Lincoln Monument. The Lincoln Monument. Because of the highway. You're right. The Lincoln Highway. What they call Interstate 80. But there's a lot of really, I mean, I know it probably drives Jeremy crazy, but I like to pull over to every one of these little things and we stop and look and you learn so much about the area and a lot of history and it's just, it's really neat. You need to stop in and check out these places. We on down the road. Yeah, I know a lot of folks like going to the beach, like going to the ocean, but y'all, this is my ocean. There y'all do. All right, y'all, we sort of rode around, did a little detour. But like I told you, if you watched the first show, I said this is a scouting and vacation scenery trip. So this is the area Sandy and I drawed antelope tags for here in, what, well, 1st September. 
And so in two months, we'll be back here out here. Uh, I hadn't seen a whole lot of goats. You know, there were several around, but man, it's pretty out here. It's, it's as green as I've ever seen it. And that may, I don't know if it's a herders or not on antelope. I am it to be driving in two months. Uh, but we've seen several. They've been several, and like I said, we hunted this area, I don't know, it's 2006, with the, brought the girls out here. Sandy shot one, Jerryanna shot one. Oh, that's been, man, it's been a long time ago. They done grown up and went their own ways now. A lot of memories here though. So, like I said, I like getting off the beaten path. Like I said, Sandy's sitting here now, just sitting here in the wind. A lot of folks like going to the beach. I've said it before, and, and waves crashing, that is very soothing, but man, this breeze blowing in the air and just looking at this big old country. It's sort of breathtaking too. Well, <laughs> oh, there's some good heifers there, yeah. Good mama cows. Shower in the woods. Is that about right, 107? Still a little, you won't be able to stand it. All right, we found us a campsite for the night. Took us a shower. Sandy, she's done in for the night because the bugs are sort of bad, but they were. They're not quite as bad now. I've been to walk a little bit, been riding so much. Yeah, I've been to this place, I don't know, 2002, 2001. Steve King and I, we, we camped in this area. Mule deer hunted in here. Steve killed a good mule deer in here. So, and it's good and chilly. <laughs>